all right guys welcome back so today we're going to be playing a game called the night shift i am pretty sure that a lot of you have probably heard about this game or possibly played it yourselves now i know a couple of days ago i said i was never going to play a puppet combo game ever again in my life and i just found out after downloading this game that it is in fact from puppet combo we're supposed to be playing as like some sort of convenience store clerk overnight, obviously the night shift, and then things happened. Things happen. Things always happen. So Amber says, or Amber, what time are you getting out? Six? Do you want me to pick you up? Uh, yeah, it's too far to walk or no, I'll get a ride. Uh, yeah, pick me up, uh, definitely. As if I'll be conked out by then. I'll have a beer for you later. Have fun. What do you even offer? What type of shitty friend is that? Welcome to the night shift. The, the, the night shift apparently starts now. We're going to be working at a gas station. And I know for a fact things are going to be a little crazy. Now, one complaint that a lot of you had when we played the nun one was that the graphics were a little bit too much. So there are multiple options. PSX. I haven't tried the PSX one. So I'm going to try it for this video. Hopefully you guys don't mind. It's still creepy. It's still got the VHS overlay over it. It's just kind of a little bit easier to see. And, you know, part of this game is that it's hard to see, which is, I believe, what makes it also scary. This is still hard to see, and it gives you the same vibe, but it's easier to read and spot certain things. But I'm going to kind of do a little bit of a lap around the gas station. I usually like to do that before. Just to make sure we know what we're dealing with. I kind of did this with the convenience store. Possibly maybe a good idea. Maybe not. The bathrooms are locked. It's okay. Hopefully we don't need to take a dump throughout the shift. This is... Why is this car here? This is the dumpster. Cats must be working tonight. Oh, there's somebody there. Oh, that's our co- Or our co-worker. Nice! We've got a co-worker! What's up, Cats? Just in time, hurry up and punch in. I've got a hot date tonight. <laughs> Bullshit. With who and was it busy today? My boy, I'm calling bullshit. Sorry. You wish. Come on, I've got to go. Did you sweep the floor at least or is the phone fixed? Hmm. Is the phone fixed? No, the telephone company never came. It's still dead. You shouldn't be making phone calls at work anyways. Oh, this is one of those guys, huh? Have you ever had one of those co-workers? Those really goody-goody co-workers that just snitch on you for everything? I've had a couple. It's okay. They're cool. Just just don't mess around with them too much. Rick, I left a list of side work that you have to do during your shift. Now I've got to go and get out of here. Oh, yeah. One more thing. I cannot find the keys anywhere. The bathrooms are locked up. So go behind the dumpster, I guess. Lovely. Have a good date. Yeah, I'm not going to be a complete douchebag. You never know. It might turn on us. My calculations are correct. I'll be uh, rounding third base in one hour and 16.32 seconds. <laughs> Bro, you're not even getting a first base. Okay, for those of you that don't know, third base is, you know, he, he scores. You know, in sexual terms, I guess. This is the gas station. Welcome to the night shift again. I guess we got to go and clock in. If I've learned anything from the convenience store is that the clock in is probably going to be... Let me see if it's... It's not here. Okay, it's going to be back here this is a little bit too fucking claustrophobic for me bro oh god products everything is what do we have here oh god extra stock oh this is not gonna be good i need a time card all right get the time card oh this is gonna suck oh there goes cats on his really hot date all right perfect so this is, okay, so this is the list. Hey guys, I'm sorry the phone line is not fixed. You'll have to be with me until, you have to bear with me until the repair guy comes. Do not worry, I'm not expecting any emergencies. Uh, I need you guys to do a better job on the sidewalk, on the side work during your shift. I'm expecting this to be finished when I come in this afternoon. So we've got a couple of things that we have to do. Sweep the floors, number one. Place items that weren't purchased back where they belong and clean the bathrooms. Would the mop be back here? Oh, fuck. If 
there's one thing I hate about playing, playing freaking. Here we go. Here we go. We've got the broom. Perfect. Excellent. Sweeping the floors. There we go. Nice. Excellent. If there's one thing that I hate about playing games in this computer is that I cannot lower the volume. And if I'm being completely honest, it sucks. Especially when I'm playing these horror games. Okay, so how long is this going to take? Seriously? Can I go outside? I don't think I can go outside. That's okay. We're going to keep sweeping the floors. I don't even know what we're doing. We're just sweeping and where are we even putting the dirt? We're just like, it's like putting shit under the bed. Oh, don't worry, mom. I cleaned my room. I totally sweep the floor, but you just sweep everything under your bed. And then 10 years later, there's like fucking rats living in your house. Maybe not 10 years. Maybe that's a little too drastic, but you know what? I'm just slightly nervous. I know that this game is scary. It may not look like it, but I know something. Oh, shoot. I thought this right here was somebody looking out in the window. Like, I don't know. I'm, I'm just... My, my mind is playing tricks on me. Almost done. The Power Drill Massacre. Oh, there's a truck there. Finished sweeping. Oh, cool. Our first customer, perhaps. And by the way, isn't the Power Drill... The Power, the power Drill Massacre. Isn't that one of their games as well? I think it is. So we, we've, we've got our first customer here. Seems to be an overnight truck driver. Oh, hello there, sir. How you doing? Uh, okay. Customer. Hi, can you give me $10 on pump five? Sure, dude. Not a problem. Everything is pretty good so far. I will put that money there. Oh, shh. Can I turn on the pumps? Did we do that right? All right, we're gonna go back to our list, guys. So we've done sweep the floors. Now we gotta place the items that were not purchased back where they belong. So the items that were not purchased. Okay, so we have beer. Okay, let's put the booze away. The booze has gotta go in one of the fridges. Oh, okay, there we go. Excellent. So the beer has been put back. What else do we have here? We've got chips, the Itos, Itos, Fritos, potatoes, potatoes, tomatoes. Okay, I'm gonna keep an eyeball on the glass. Make sure no strange business. Oh, right here. Make sure no strange business is going down. Not outside my property, damn it. And then we've got motor oil. Now, where the hell does motor oil go? Oh, <laughs> car accessories. So we've done the second task. Wow, I think we're doing pretty damn good. And now it's clean the bathrooms. Well, see, the problem here is that I don't know where the keys are at. And apparently, neither does my coworker. So now we got to find the keys to the bathroom. And I think this is when shit's going to get crazy. So, can I go outside first and foremost? I cannot leave the store. That's just fantastic. And there is... Yo. Oh, okay, he's coming in. Okay, we've possibly got another customer. Alright. Insert the coin. No, not, not, not right now. What the hell is that? Okay. Hello? My guy, are you going to park the car or what's the deal with you? Hey, dirtbag, this is a gas station. There is nothing in this world more suspicious than a white van. I'm just going to say that. Nothing more suspicious than a white van. If you ever see a white van going at like five miles an hour, then you probably got a problem. Okay? So clean the bathrooms. Oh, there's another customer. Perfect. Okay. Here we go. Customer number two. 
Excellent. He's pulling up. She's pulling up. Oh, hello there, cutie. <laughs> Hi. Can I help you? Where are you headed? Hi. Can I help you? Yes. I just need some cigarettes. Okay. Which brand? You want to tell me which brand? Uh, Banshee Red with uh, filters. Okay, sweetheart. I'm kind of new here. So, okay, here we go. Have your Banshee Reds. Thanks. No problem. The customer says, can I use the bathroom? I can't open it. Well, that's weird. Good luck. Uh... Don't leave the store. I cannot leave the store. Okay. Um. Okay, so what the heck am I supposed to do here? Am I really just literally supposed to roam around and wait for another customer? I, I, I don't know where the keys are at. I can't clean the bathroom. That's my last task. Okay, maybe we can go ahead and play a little bit of uh, the power drill. <laughs> oh! What the fuck is... Sh fuck that! The hell is that? Jesus Christ! Freaking ears, man! Nah, dude. Fuck that, dude. That's way too loud. Shoot, here comes the van again. What is up with you, man? Listen, if you gotta pump the gas, come and pump the fucking gas. I'll be roaming around my freaking gas station. I I will kill you. Okay, he just totally, if this was more realistic, he would have probably collapsed the entire column and he probably would have been dead. But he just, he just simply just drove. What are you doing, dude? I'm right here. I'm watching you. Genius. I don't understand how such a simple game be so creepy. I don't get it. Okay, this is a bit of... Yeah, that's super sus. Okay. See, at first I thought it was just probably whatever. But now, now I'm actually very, very intrigued. What the heck? Okay, I'm gonna go to the back and see if I find something else. Cameras, can't look at the cameras, nothing in the cameras. Locked, every time I try and open that door, it scares the crap out of me. We've got the wooden door here. Nothing extra. Excellent, go back outside. All right, do we have another customer, please? I've only had two customers the entire shift. I'm quite depressed, lonely, and uh, most importantly, very scared. Okay, it's mostly portal mags. <laughs> gas station, bro. What type of gas station is this? <laughs> um. Oh shit! Hey, there's a customer coming. Customer, hi. You here all alone? No, my coworker's in the back. Why the hell would you even ask me that? Uh, I'm gonna lie to this dude. What the hell was the point of that? Uh, okay. Why would you come in here and ask me if I'm alone? What type of dumb question is that? This dude is so tall. He can he can just look past the shelves. Look at him. Just look at him. Look at him. You think this is a game? Well, technically it is, but this is my duty. This is my job. I take pride in this shit. Uh, sir, what are you doing? 
Are you going to buy something? We've got cigarettes. We've got donuts. Hey, we even got porn magazines. If you're into that stuff at 2 o'clock in the morning. Okay, he's just going back and forth now. Uh, dude. I don't appreciate this. You're going to get a beer. Maybe he's going to get... Oh, okay. Here we go. He got a beer. Okay. We've got an alcoholic on the loose. Hey there, bucko. Uh, okay. Uh, thank you. Okay. Have a good day, sir. All right. Perfect. So, so far, every single customer that's come in has been relatively normal. That's probably the first one that I would say is a little, a little iffy. Now, I know I've seen that guy everywhere as far as like the promotions of the games and stuff. So I know that character is probably of big importance. Okay, so now what do we do? We've had three customers so far. The last one, one came to pump and gas. The second one, I forgot what she wanted, but she wanted to use the bathroom, which is out of service. The wood door. The last one came for a beer, it seems. Oh, God. I still have no idea. I cannot go out. I have no idea where these keys are at. Clean the bathrooms. I can't clean the, ba the bathrooms. Yeah, we're going to go back here. What the f What the frick? Oh my god, this is oh, This is the door that was locked. Okay. Um Hello? Okay, so maybe I can, I can... Oh! Okay, now. Nothing special. Can I clean the bathrooms? I mean, it was part of the task, right? What the freaking hell? <laughs> what the freaking... That, that's it? I'm going to give this another go, but we're going to choose a different option and see if anything changes. So just in time, hurry up and punch in. I've got a hot date tonight. So we're going to go ahead and ask him with who. And he says, wouldn't you like to know? <laughs> Come on, I've got to go. Did you sweep the floors at least? Is the phone fixed? Sorry, dude, I was too busy. Hey, Rick left a list of side work to do on your shift. Now I've got to get out of here. Oh, yeah, and most, uh, one more thing. I cannot find the keys anywhere. Uh, the bathrooms are still locked up. So behind the dumpster, I guess. Lovely. Hey, I'm just trying to be pragmatic. What? Pra pragmatic? Pract pragmatic. Pragmatic. Pract pragmatic. Pragmatic. <laughs> you should try some time. Okay. Hold on, dude. I can barely read. I'm going to go back to the PSX graphics. So we're going to go back in here. We're going to punch in. We already know everything we got to do. So everything's going to be good and gravy. Um, let's see if something's changed around here. It's going to be interesting. We're also going to be, we're going to be trying to play the, what do you call this? The, this. So first and foremost, we're going to go back here. We're going to do our chores pretty fast. Okay. I gotta, Okay. Stop. Stop. Here's the broom. We're going to get out. We're going to start sweeping the floor. Excellent. I don't know if we're going to get different uh, individual characters come in based on our choices. I would assume whenever a game gives you multiple choice, some things do alter and whatnot, but I don't know. Okay, I've got everything. Let me get that. Can I carry any more items? Okay, so we'll put the beer back over here. Excellent. Okay, and then after the beer, we've got the... Let me get this. We've got the chips, which go right up in here. 
And we've also got... Oh, no, it was in the car accessories, right? Yeah. It was right over here. Perfect. Hi, can you give me $10 on pump five? Yes, sir, I can. Ciao now. I will see you later. And please do not come back. Now, I'm, I'm starting to wonder, is one of the customers that comes in, is is the guy that killed us, is, is it one of the customers? Because he's the tallest. Well, he's, he might be the last one, to be honest. Maybe he just changed outfits, or maybe he's got a friend. They're playing along, and they're, they were planning to kill us all along, and I don't fucking know, but... Kind of interesting. Oh, what the fuck? Oh. <laughs> Can you turn the goddamn pump on? <laughs> I was just... Sure. <laughs> I forgot. Oh, dude, I forgot. I'm sorry, dude. I'm new here, okay? Hi, can I help you? Uh, where are you headed? East? I didn't realize how spooky it is over here before I stopped. But anyways, can I have a pack of Banshee Red Filters? Uh, sure, here. Have your Banshees. Thanks. Yeah, sure, no problem. Oh, hey. Can I use the bathroom? No. God, well, fine. Have a nice life. <laughs> oh, shit, I thought there was somebody behind me. Have a nice life, she said. A nice life I will have. Got my eye on you. I don't know who the hell you think you are roaming around my damn gas station. But I've got my fucking eye on you. I'm gonna put yes. Yes, I am. Yeah, you keep doing what you're doing. You keep looking back at me, you little stinking. That's right. Gotta be careful, man. That is all. Just gotta be careful. It's like he goes to every single aisle and then he looks over at me and then he continues. Now he's going to the porn magazines. Or not. That's actually the don't that's that's the pastry section, sir. Watch, he's gonna look over there he is. I freaking knew it. You're as predictable as they come. But I've got my eye on you. Better pull that door open and grab a beer. I said do it. There you go. Little biatch. Come on over and give me the money. That's right. The funny thing is he doesn't even look half scary. He's just a little sus. So then that becomes scary. All right, dude. What happens if I turn my back to him? He does nothing. Excellent. All right, so here he goes. He will disappear into the wind like a turd. All right, so now we got to go back over here. The door should oh, the door's not open yet. Holy smokes. Okay, so it takes a while for the door to open, it seems interesting. Okay, I think I heard the door open. There it is. Okay, so check this out, okay? We're outside. By the dumpster. Okay, I'm gonna go back to the streets. Dude, this is creepy. This is like in the middle of nowhere. This is insane. 
This is absolutely insane. I will go back in here. I'm not going to go inside. <laughs> Fucking shit. I don't know why I get these like vein pains every time I get like a really bad scare. It's like this pain on my neck. I can't even. Oh, it's annoying, dude. It's so bad. It's like a brain freeze, but on my neck. I was not expecting that at all. Like that. None of it. But that last thing, like it was everything was the, the last scare was so bad. Much worse than the bathroom one, I think. I don't well, not much. The bathroom one was pretty nuts. It's just this one's more recent and I'm so, I'm so traumatized. But I'm got I'm glad I replayed it. I hope you guys enjoyed. <laughs> and as always, stop recommending me these damn puppet combo games. They're too scary, damn it. But uh if you want more horror, drop it a like. The better these videos continue to do, the more I will do for you guys. So I'm gonna take a break. Catch you later.